Having a car at SEMA is an honor. It's basically the biggest car show in the world. It's over a million square feet. There's supposedly over 150,000 people there. So for us to be basically dead in the center of that, right in Center Hall in Hotchkiss's booth, you know, an amazing company that we've used their products for years, definitely one of the coolest things. For anyone who's never been to SEMA or brought a car inside, it's absolute chaos. There's people all over the place. So we pull up to the booth. Obviously, it's Hotchkiss's booth, so we want to showcase their suspension. The only way to do that with a car that's low like this is to put it up on a stand. Backing it up some race ramps is not what I want to do right off the bat. We didn't have a lot of room. We were pretty tight up against the door. So I kind of had to basically just back up the ramps and trust everyone around me. We had to re-rack it a couple times. There wasn't much room in front of the car to reposition ourselves at all, but we were able to do it. We were able to get up on the ramps. Hi, John Hotchkiss here. Day one of SEMA is almost over. It has flown by. And the reason it's been so exciting is all of our new products, but you have to see this car behind me. Funkmaster Flex's LT5 powered 68 Chevelle, all of our Hotchkiss suspension, and our brand new electronic coilovers that are Bluetooth controlled right on your phone. So the customer who we built the car for, obviously everybody knows it's DJ Funk Flex. While we were at the show last year, we got hooked up with John from Hotchkiss basically invited us out to bring this year's build to his booth, which was absolutely amazing. So the main company behind this build, Hotchkiss obviously, we're in the Hotchkiss booth. We've got their brand new suspension on the car. This is their Bluetooth controlled coilover setup. This car is gonna handle great and ride even smoother when you just wanna cruise. We're so excited to have our electronic coilovers here. We've worked very hard with Falcon Shocks to have upgraded apps, to have more benefits, more features. Just to be in a booth with that quality of a company was absolutely amazing. Basically just getting to interact with everybody is one of my favorite parts of building the cars. You know, it's, it's always fun to, to have that kind of conversation with someone who knows what they're looking at and appreciates that kind of work. So I think everybody really loved the car. One of the details that stood out the most was the paint. Another company that helped us out huge on this build was BASF. Obviously the main focal point of any car is gonna be the paint job. With this car we went with the Charisma line. This is the red candy over a violet base and we went with the Glazerit Clear to finish out the top to make it look nice and slick. I think the paint was pretty special. We made a custom formula. Basically that light that drew everyone in to see everything else on the car. Latest and greatest technology going in the car. LT5 motor, Tremec 6 speed, Hotchkiss all new coilover suspension system, and the car is being built six inches wider. Two fenders, two doors, two quarters, all cut up, made three inches wider on each side. So as you can see with this car, it looks a little different from a normal 68 Chevelle. It's three inches wider on each side. So for that, we needed twice the sheet metal. Luckily, Original Parts Group helped us out. They supplied us with four quarter panels, four fenders, all the parts we needed to make this car twice as wide. So big help to us was McGuire's. We used their compound, their spray wax, just everything to make sure that paint job looks as good as it can at all times. All right, so obviously no matter what motor you have and what kind of horsepower you're making, it's not gonna sound good unless it's coming through a good exhaust. Luckily, we had pipes hook us up with their Race Pro muffler and cap back stainless steel exhaust for the 68 Chevelle. So what's next for 612? We're gonna be doing a SEMA Battle of the Builders Young Guns car for next year. So everyone stay tuned for that. We're gonna be doing some weekly vlogs on it. So if you wanna see a little more behind the scenes of what goes on in the shop, definitely subscribe to the channel and stay tuned. You're not gonna to wanna to miss it. Should I drop the mic? <laughs> no, 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 don't drop the mic. <laughs> I'm gonna drop the mic. <laughs>